All right, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. It's been a long few days, guys, but we are back and we are ready to get this done. Um, <clears throat> last episode, I spent a very long time on one macabre sculpture. This episode, we should have spent very little time on each. <laughs> Not trying to jinx myself, though. So, without further ado, let's get on going to Bitter Black Island. So, we need seven more. <clears throat> Actually, while I'm on the way here, what would be a good use of my time? I forgot what I need to upgrade the king, the cursed king's belt, but I need to upgrade it, so. I'm gonna go ahead and start that process right here, right now. Then after that, there's one item. Since I got the dragon king knight's cloak last time, I also looked into the Dragon Knight's helm, and there are some boxes here in Post Diamond Middle Black where you can get that as well. So I'm going to. Do I carry it? Yes, I am. Uh, eventual Mirror. So I need to do the Eventual Mirror. Okay. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and farm that item real quick. It shouldn't be a difficult farm. Uh, since it is even a pre-Everfall item. Uh, realistically, you can get it before ever going to the Everfall, which means that even though it was nearly impossible to do outside the Everfall, it should be fairly easy to do inside of post on BBI. Knocking on, not trying to jinx myself, right? Uh, where the heck is this mirror at? Okay. So once you hit your badges of vows you've gone past uh Grancis items so it should be in the same area as all the rest of the stuff that they drop though I think they drop red crystals right well and crystal yeah here we are so that's the vision error I'll not beat round the bush hash well, well good, good thing I have a lot of money sure so I'm gonna need to do that one more time <laughs> Uh, I think actually farming one of those is probably more, because of that extraordinary price, farming one of those is probably a better move than, uh, let me check my level, because I gotta switch over at level 144, ooh, I'm very close, yikes, once I get to level 144, I gotta swap over to, I think, assassin, or was it ranger, I think it's assassin, I don't think I got anything else. Okay, so first we're going to start in the Garden of Ignominy. I don't remember if I got <coughs> this particular um, statue, but it's worth looking. Okay, if I'm not mistaken, it's like up on a beam, right? Good job, me. How'd you screw that up? Okay, there it is, yep. On a rock next to a beam. Alright, so actually we want to hit this chest, I believe, right? So, there's four chests in just the Garden of Ingemon nominee by itself that have the Dragon Knight's Hell. And we just want to hit one of them. Three of these chests don't have any man-eaters in them. One of them does. That's the one that's out in the main courtyard area where you normally fight stuff. But we're going to hit one of these three chests. So both the chests in this particular room have the, uh, wait, am I tripping? Nope. Actually, no, I'm too high. This is chest number nine. Chests number 10 and 11 are on the floor. So that wasn't even the right chest to begin with. There are three chests in this room, and the two in the lower level are what give you the item. So 
Mage's Parry app. I forgot what Mage's Parry app does. But it's not Monk's Parry app, so it's not important. Okay. Ground level, which means that it's good. Grizzly Skull. Nice. First try. Unfortunately, I don't want it. It'd be great if I wanted money, but I don't want a Grizzly Skull. Because I got it in pre-Diamond. Bit of Black Island. And basically what I'm trying to demonstrate here is that you could do it here in far less than 20 minutes it took me to do it in the Tainted Mountain Temple. Now, we're about to see if that's true. There we go. Third try. Dragon Knight's Helm. I'll take this. I'll take it and sell it. So I went through the trouble of getting it in the first place. So... You can get that item way easier on BBI than you can. Otherwise, now that we're done, with, now that we're done with that, we are pretty much done with the Garden of Ignominy. Let me check chest number. It should be chest number. What eighteen? Does eighteen have something I care about? No, just novelty level one or two. Okay, yeah, we'll move on to the next area then. Hmm. I'm going to just open up the wiki guide anyway. Oh, yeah, and I guess there's probably some in, in like the sea that I've missed. So, actually, what I'll do is. There's no, like, quick way to climb off. Oh, yeah, you just don't jump, jump, jump off from there. Okay. Okay. So, sculpture number, you know, if I'm not mistaken, it's just going to be on this, like, rocky flat, right? Yeah, I think it's just on the rocky flat. Alright, so now I need six more. I started with 13, I got one that's 14. to see if I if I got if I got some sauce this episode. Alright, first sauce check good to go. Another sauce check. Brian had a little bit more sauce than I did, I got it. Alright, so uh let's try this again. Um sauce check. up, run back, jump, turn around. No! Okay, that thing has no kind of grip on you. Like, if you, if you're not ready to go, it, it's just gonna take you. space as possible so I can actually get a run. Can you stop? I can't see under my... This, these tooltips are just getting in my way. Dang it! I can't jump. I literally can't jump because these stupid tooltips keep on popping up. Like, how do I turn that off? Can I turn that off? Yeah, yeah. Stop that.
And it's not just the tooltips that are making me unable to jump, but they are making it a lot harder. <laughs> I'll tell you that much. Stop it. Go away, tooltip. There we go. See, I can't blame that one on the tooltip. I just didn't get any type of. Actually, they said it's impossible with just double jump unless you have like ultralight going for you. Um, let's see. I'm not anywhere near ultralight. I'm average right now. I could probably get my weight down. The meaning of this pray permit me to help if there is aught up. I'll just put away some parry apps real fast. No, that's not going to do enough. Hold up. I probably need to put away this helmet as well. Or sell it, rather. Yeah, I'll sell this helmet real fast. If there is all that pray, permit me to pray. You feel and then just if you if you've the need, what will it be? If you've the need, what will it be then? Good chunk of change, actually. What will it be if no? The meaning. Pray, permit me to, if there is aught I can. And I think I have ultra light or what you call it on. Um, no, I don't. Um, acuity. Okay. That's probably from something I was doing before. Um, let's go leg strength, and that'll get me down to very light. If there is all pray, pray. Okay. So freaking hard to get a freaking running jump going. Yeah, that's the problem, is that you don't get that extra long jump. Let's try it without the long jump. Let's just try, like, trying to sweet spot it. Nope. Now I'm not sure if there's enough space. Because I think the run speed the run speed is affected directly by your uh by your weight so that's why you would want to decrease your encumbrance in the first place dang it okay i really don't feel like getting stuck on this i really don't feel like, i just got i just came back from getting stuck on a really dumb sculpture before i'd rather go kill daimon and come back for this sculpture from the high side. Think, wait, I'm an idiot. I'm a total idiot. I'm an idiot. Watch this. <laughs> Watch 
what I'm talking about, the high side. <laughs> what I'll just go to it. <laughs> I'm a strider. Darn it. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Uh, like. Let's save here. Alright, this is way easier than trying to sweet spot a jump. Sorry, Rangers. You're going to have to figure it out. Now, the question is, did I already grab this thing? The first time? No, I didn't. It's right there. Alright, cool. That's numero uno. <laughs> Alright. Pretty sure I got that already. Alright, number four is in the Dust Moon Tower. Yeah, I already got the one that was up there. So, that gives us 15, we need 5 more. I'm going to swap to clout. You feel just what if you've the need and the coin or adhesion one of the two. If you've the need, what will it be then? Clout probably. And then what will it be then? Our skills. Wouldn't it be then? If you've the need, wouldn't withdraw. It be? I wanna withdraw those peri apps that I put away before. Eight and eight. Wouldn't it be then? I'm gonna deposit this here. The cops closure. Wouldn't it be if you know? All right, solid. And I'll take a checkpoint for sanity's sake. Okay, cool. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. Um. So we're gonna go down now. And baby, we're going down. And sugar, we're going down swinging. I'll be your number one. Baby. All right, goblins. Oh, you lucky dog. I went off of through all the trouble of not splatting. Um, do I kill whatever's here? I have no idea what comes up. Okay.
be too far away, bro. Can't even hit you with this. Alright, anyway. He's no threat right now, so let's see where we, this one is. Dustman Tower. Top of a pillared next to southwest gem doors. Um, I'm not exactly sure where the southwest gem doors are. Let's open up that tab real quick. Alright, looks like it's up here. So, let's go this way. Pretty freaking high. I'm pretty sure this has nothing to do with. What I'm looking for. There you go. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, I need to stop getting hit by that. too high again. Alright, I guess I'll just drop down to, uh, yeah, let's do it. Let's go splitter. And then, it's supposed to be on, like, I think this is it. Right here. That thing looks so pathetic, just follow me around. Like, you ain't got a job or something, bro? Just gonna follow me around the entire time? Alright, number five. At the very right angle of the corner of the upper ledge and east, on the roof of the building that leads to the Ward of Regret. So that's the Ward of Regret over there. I might have already got this one. I'm not sure. We're actually at a good height right now, so I don't like it. It's really hard to get this guy to... Get a little bit of an angle on you. No. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I grabbed this like very early in. Like a hundred percent sure I got grab this. <coughs> I 
Oh no, it's the second floor. <coughs> All right, now you're too high again. Good. Um, I just drop down here. the water we got out of again? Here. Oh. Let's see if I can make it. That's a terrible move. You take so much damage from it. Can I freaking hit the... Kick the door then. Oh, it's right there too. I just need to literally stop jobbing. I got this. Oh gosh. Oh. Thankfully, he's out of range because that was bad timing. Here it is. That was annoying. Oh. All right, into the next room. That was number 17. Actually, no. This is not the next room. Oh, I like how he starts out of place because he's normally trying to float up to get to see you. This is actually quite potentially bad. Fortunately, he wasn't in a good spot to actually hit me with it. On a block north of... Just west of Northwest Torch. Oh, great. Oh, is that a... Hmm. I don't know if those are whites or licious, but I might want to take them down. I'll do it. Don't know where it drops went. Oh, there's one. Oh, nice. That's the other ventral mare I need, so that's great.
Okay. Well, since I already got Vengeful Mirror number three, what I can do now is I can just, where is it? Set the block just west of Northwest Torch. We'll find out until we go. Oh, oh. Do we take a leap of faith? Is it up there meaning Northwest Torch or over here meaning Northwest Torch? I'm thinking. Is this three licious? What kind of. Oh wow. Was not ready for that. For that smoke. Just some king worship in this arena. I don't know how to get up there. I can keep it real with y'all. Um, or do I get up there? Right here. Got it. That's 17. Y'all can't stop me. I be laughing. Ah, ha, ha, ha. They can't catch me. They can't stop them. I be by them goons. If you can't beat them, then you pop them. Alright. That's over with, thankfully. Okay. I hate post down on bitter black for this <laughs> like you, you just don't get those those rests oh there's one I missed that was in the nasty water in the midnight helix um if I go that route do I even have a lift stone I do I think I'm gonna skip this one though. I think I will. Um, fall to foul truth in the upper level of the southernmost room on top of a wooden rafter. I'm pretty sure that's just like where we go to get the uh, the weapon level twos and stuff early on, right? The armor level two ones and stuff. I might have already grabbed it though. There you go. I always take the express route down. Oh, that's just a poet. That's fine though, it's a free it's a free heal. Another poet. Another free heal. What does detrit Alright, we're gonna chat, we're about to figure something out. What is detritivorous mean? It has to mean that it feeds on rot, right? Detritivorous. Detritivor. An animal that feeds on dead organic flesh or dead organic material, especially plant detritus. Um, 
So how's that different from a? I guess scavengers just look for dead things. So scavengers look for dead animals, and I guess. No. Okay. Okay. It's a little bit different. I guess you wouldn't want to call a plant a scavenger as well, so this is more of a scientific thing. Hi guys, bye guys. Oh crap. Darn! Is there any way I can jump? Oh, dang. I'm having a bad time. I might just be dead, yeah. Okay. So getting there, getting to the room wasn't a problem. Staying alive in the room is going to be a real problem, I was like, wow, it's really chill down here. No, I, I just hadn't gotten to the to the pain yet. <laughs> to the pain and the misfortune. Okay, can I get up? That was 18, right? Stop me! All this work just to try to stop a man who can't be stopped. Ooh, which way am I going? I wasn't sure which way I was going, but this looks like the right way. Anyway, oh, freaking pawns always startle me. All right, um, we're at eighteen, I think, seventeen or eighteen, one of the two. Okay, so. Wait, where'd my list go? Alright, anyway. Yeah, that was the only macabre sculpture there. Um, next one's in the Warrior's Respite, so we'll stop there. Missed. He did bump into me, but I guess he didn't have action frames on at that point in time, so it didn't matter. Oh, 
All right, so <clears throat> in the vault of defiled truth, no. Top of the pillar south of the fountain. Okay, so up there. I think I can see it too. There we go. Sweet enough. I'll speak no ill of others' dreams. If you've then what will it be? I'll use that. Got rid of all of them, it wouldn't make a difference in my weight. I have five of those. Okay. Wouldn't it be then? I have 20. Okay, never mind. I don't have to do anything. I have 20 already. Cool. My counting is subpar, I suppose. To the surface. That'll get us the trophy pants. The means pray permit me if there is all type of. It would actually help if I withdrew them all to my inventory. Maybe. Kinda sorta. If there is all pray. Trophy boots. Pray permit if there is Okay. We like those. If there is all pray pray. Okay, so now we have trophy pants. Okay, carry weight. Nice, nice, nice. We will trade those out. I know I keep saying pants, but... I don't know. Oh yeah, we'll do that. The me pray pray permit me if there is apparently striker's screws were really heavy. If there is all I can do, if there is all I can do, are they that heavy? That they make that much of a difference? Um, doesn't tell me how much much away. One ten 
compare it to the iron. Uh, no, it's only a difference of 0.5. I don't see it. Let's bring something else. If there is aught I can do. If there is aught, pray permit me to help you now as well. So Alright. Let's go upgrade our Curse King belt. Oh no, you know what it was? It's because of the bonus that it increases my uh yep. That's what it is. Because it's increasing my carry weight. I can do that now. So what it, what is my new like limit? It's probably pretty decent. Um Nope, it's only like a couple more. But it is lighter than the striker's grief, so that's also good. Go get that vengeful mirror. And then I gotta make a decision about what to try the dragon forge. And then if I want to try to get dragon blood while I'm at it, I think I might do that. I think I might go for a Dragon Forge, Dragon Blood type deal. Seen this? Tis. I'm sure you'll find all you need here. We I'm sure you'll find all you need anytime. Um, no need for anything else. The only reason I'm not taking, um. His, uh, what you call it? I'm not, I'm not like doing anything else. It's because I just don't want to. Um... I just jump down to the hole at this point, right? Oh wow, I guess I'm very close to very light. Never mind then. Was it the scroll of fortune? Yeah, I'm not really worried about that. I'll take the mission, but I'm not worried about it. That's not something that is completely uh, unique. Nor is it something that helps, to say the least. Fortune gives you more money. It doesn't give you more Rift Crystals, if I'm not mistaken. And which you really want a Rift Crystal, so who cares? Um, I only came back here to take a quick, uh, a quick rest. Okay, we're about an hour in, or well, we're less than an hour in, but one thing I do want to do, I do want to test out that theory on the wiki that dragon blood can drop for, from dragons here. Um, is this the setup I want? That's the real question. Impact is fine. Awareness. I guess I could go with clout and acuity to increase my damage just that much more. Instead of impacts, but nah. We jump kick our way into into Hever Falls around here, boy. All right, that's number eight, and here's number ten. 
please remember that the worm is just a number 10. If you remember that, you're good. Um, yeah, let's just go for it. Oh, I guess I'm very close to very light, so it gave me a ton of... It gave me actually, a like, a ton of, uh, encumbrance resistance. Yeah, this is definitely, this is definitely slower. That's definitely slower. Uh, Curse King's Belt, not the trophy piece though. And I think the slowest part of the process is having to check. Like, okay. Because I don't know if the ring is going to look like a ring, because Dragon Blood is a ring. So I don't know if it's going to fall on the ground and look like a ring, or if it's going to fall on the ground and look like, you know, uh, a bagged item, like uh, Heaven's Keys does. Not Heaven's Keys, yeah. Divine Razors. So that's my biggest deal with uh, this whole thing. I, don't, I have no idea what it's actually going to look like when it falls. If it falls, of course. Stone tear. Yeah, no dragon blood. Now it would make perfect sense for, and apparent apparently it, they're supposed to be in the low list for the Everfall, right? In the drop list for the Everfall. Nobody corroborated that report, but it looks legit, and it would make sense that you could get a dragon blood from farming dragons in the Everfall. I just don't know if anybody's ever seen it, at least anybody who's ever posted on Wiki. So this is definitely me just trying stuff. Um, I'll try it like a couple more times. Excuse me, I'm sorry, I had the thing on. I'll try it like a couple more times, but I'm not gonna make this a long like farming run for this video because I intend to end this video like here-ish. Uh, I might try it a couple more times at the beginning of the next video as well, if I don't get my drop. That or a double, um, if I get a double, yeah, we break everything around here, boy. If I get a double Dragon Forge, I'll stop as well. So breaking the items or breaking wings and stuff, I do want to ensure I'm breaking as much stuff on the dragon as possible. Um, the more stuff you break, the more items you get, obviously. Maybe not that obviously, but it, it does work. Yeah, no dragon blood that time either. All right, let's try it again. All 
I'm not sure if this is a faster dragon blood farm. If it works, I gotta measure then is it a faster dragon blood farm than just hitting a box over and over? Because that's the real question. Like, even if it works, is it faster? Stop that. It's really slow if I miss everything like I did this time. And then it's super slow if I can't even get to the items, right? Um, uh, I break these, see if it works. Dragon scale. It's supposed to be a 1% drop, by the way. So, now granted, a 1% drop if you get 4 drops every single run, probably not that bad. And But I think this would be a way more entertaining farm. I think this is more entertaining than hitting a box over and over and God's baiting over and over. Like, that is mind-numbingly boring. Not getting my damage, boy. Give me that wing. chance of getting it from the Ur Dragon. Is there a chance of getting it from the Ur Dragon? I don't know. Then again, does Erdy I guess Erdy does bleed, but it bleeds like purple blood. Even if there was like a 1% chance per heart, that would be pretty bad. No. I'm trying to hear all that. Uh, slow me down there. But then again... Those, uh, what you call it, are supposed to be 1% drops, too. Not 1%, 5%. Those, uh, tiers are supposed to be 5% drops as well, so... It might not be that bad. Because of how many items you get per run. All right, well, I'm gonna call it here. As always, I've been myself, you've been awesome. Peace, chicken.